The Whiskey Brothers Podcast is intended for an adult listening audience. If you find yourself easily offended, I guarantee this will do it. They don't want no problem. Nah. From Houston, Texas. The Whiskey Brothers Podcast starts now. Welcome to the Whiskey Brothers Podcast, everybody. Hello, episode 793. Uh, hellos to everybody watching us on video, as well as uh, those of you who have got this thing stuck in your ears now. Uh, that's Roxy Hayes waving at the camera. Oh, we got a new face. Um, Roxy, you have not been on the show before. No. Uh, we have, we, we endeavor to be, uh, we, we try to bring some women on. Well, it's National Women's Day. On uh, National oh, Women's yeah. Day. International, uh, International, International yeah. Women's Day. Yeah. We, try to be, we try to be diverse. Uh, and we raise a <laughs> Is that class. for everybody? <laughs> I put a black dude on here. Shut your mouth. This is. <laughs> No. Uh, no, that's so not why you're here. You're here because you're fucking fun. Um, cheers to Roxy oh, Hayes. Oh, we're already hitting it. Cheers already to you guys. It. Uh, it's that. a bottle. We got a bottle of Jameson. Uh, which one is this? The uh, this is the <laughs> Irish. Oh yeah, don't uh, shoot it if you're not. Oh my god. The castmates with the oh, stout this, edition. Oh god, this is the stout one. Oh, oh it's the good fuck, stuff. Fuck, I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah, so it's it's not stout. It's just yeah. aged in a stout cask, yeah, Rob. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Don't take still, it too seriously. Oh, God, I'm so yeah, sick of this. Uh, shouts out, watch, <laughs> yeah. Shouts out to uh, Anna in yeah. Dallas for the uh, for like the bottle. It, yeah. it, it tastes like co- it does, oh, coffee. Okay. Yeah, it's got a little bit of a no stout. Oh, it tastes like yeah. You don't whiskey. like it at all. That tastes good. It burns. I'll put some something. Oh. We'll put that right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll put you over <laughs> there with Trey. Uh That's fine. Trey, before that, I'm I'm I want to talk to you so much, but I <laughs> before the show man? started, before it started, you 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 go, hey man, why ain't there just planes for babies? Wait, what? There should <laughs> there should be just planes for for babies because everybody complains that about is, babies yeah, yeah. being on planes. Uh huh. So put them in a, like how, a little box? Like they do with the I, I'm just saying they could put milk in powder. <laughs> And that's what children survive on. That's you can't build a plane just for them? Oh, I thought you were saying let's powder babies yeah, and then just add some water to yeah, them when they get is, to Cincinnati. Is, no, oh. I don't believe in that teleporting shit. But uh, <laughs> isn't that what teleporting is? Like just putting particles from one spot to the next and yeah. then you say, oh, they, they kind of did that. And I was like, there should be more of a solid example. We'll, we'll, we'll table that for a minute. <laughs> yeah, hey. let's, should be more of a solid example. Babies. Go back We're to the babies. We're just all babies on the plane by themselves? It should be 250 like car seats. <laughs> I like this. You, you can, can put you can put five hundred babies. Yeah, whatever. Because they're small. But now yeah. hang on. They could be a first class. Who's yeah. gonna watch the babies? Right. Who's you in charge? The of flight attendants. Yeah, Hello. Flight attendants. flight attendants ain't nothing. And but, they ain't gotta but, do shit now because there's no drinks or food service. It's this is no different than a daycare. No, this is brilliant. No. This, this is, motherfucker. This, is this is sky no. daycare. Of all the shit he has <laughs> given us in this show. <laughs> Rob, this is fucking brilliant. Rob, that's like setting up for human trafficking. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. all it can be. And it's fine. 500 babies. That's you so be easy. A, an air trafficking controller. Oh my yeah, God. Human trafficking controller. And you can go to like <laughs> 10 cities. No. Oh you can just fly around taking these babies. Y'all need to go to jail. Look, I'm <laughs> saying start domestically. The, the, that, that that you're bringing up, oh the sex God, trafficking thing. Yeah, like that's, a, yeah. But that sounds like an international problem. No. He as far as through flight. Trey, your plan right you now. Put, you I, put, I feel like if you ran your you plan through a focus group, by the time you got to an end, you guys would be like, let's just stick them in railroad cars. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm not. I'm saying it. I'm just saying once you slap Delta they, on it. They can yeah. stay at the port for like three days without. <laughs> now, no. granted, you'll have to have a separate one for the Jewish kids. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. So, so, oh all God. right. So, but as a as a parent, you just yeah. relinquish your child. At they the, do it all the time. Bro. They, put no, kids, they, uh, they put kids on planes all the time. I but they're not babies. Yeah. But these babies will have a fucking. Bro, they're uh, soft and a, floppy. Yeah. No, they'll, no, they'll have. They'll be in a little container. <laughs> they will have a fucking barcode. Rob, do y'all <laughs> have kids? No. 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 That's why we should be allowed to do exactly. this. Exactly. We are reasonable people. See, I haven't lost our minds I, because we have kids. I come from a more humane place where I think this is beautiful. Rob, Greg. hang on. I think babies are fine on planes. Oh, Jesus. Hang on. As long as I get, as long as I don't just have to swallow the negatives. Everybody wants me on a plane <laughs> to only deal with the crying part and the screaming part and the ear popping, shitty diaper changing part. Yeah. If you let me hug the kid, like if I could just walk around and hug a stranger's baby, no. now it's weird. <laughs> but now, now, now you made it weird. <laughs> don't do that. I'm just <laughs> don't try that no shit because I have not seen anybody stop a politician from kissing their fucking baby. <laughs> I would. So you would just <laughs> let them fly in the sky. <laughs> They, no. they, they they didn't save hands. No, less shit happens in the sky. Do you think? <laughs> nothing, ha- nothing. Nothing. 
they just be in a sealed container. <laughs> Wait, there's like a, there'll be holes in it. You're gonna, <laughs> been depending very, on how long the flight is. You vacuum seal a baby? No, it's a it's a sealed container. Uh, leave, you leave your head out. Oh my you know, god! You leave the head out. I'm no, so glad serious. I didn't. Oh, know. Like, like I you, almost brought my child. This is <laughs> fucking terrible. So you're so a, you're a, you're a mother. Yes. Uh, how old is your kid? She's eleven. Eleven. All right. When she was she's a, a fucking fly. adult, <laughs> she's a <laughs> black eleven. I would never uh, let you. Twenty three. I wouldn't let you hug my baby when she was a baby. I wouldn't let you hug her now. I'm this just. Well, gross. yeah, it would be weird at eleven. But like the good the good parts of of babies are like you get oh I got the whole thing in the kiss and it was sleeping on my shoulder that part if if I got those parts I deal with your but I wouldn't let a stranger do that then why do i have to tolerate the crying you don't okay so roxy (laughs) put headphones on somebody's with your kid now yes and you'll be here for a couple hours right same as flying no it's not (laughs) it's the fucking same it's a break here's the difference and now you're playing nanny that knows my child and i know them and i've done the background not a random ass bitch on a flight with other random ass babies they can be nanny approved nope (laughs) good that could be a part of the resume 200 babies you know how hard it is to watch 200 to 500 babies? Oh, my God. You know how hard it is to watch two? Yes. It's not a, daycares you have 30 to 50 you, people. You don't realize <laughs> they're going to be in containers. <laughs> 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 Y'all need to go to no, wait a second. You gotta stuff the babies. In no. a, now, hang on. There's something to be said here. If you can get, if you can get no. six, if you can get like a six pack where you can just carry them. Up. Well, I mean like a. I don't, I don't know where you went with the six pack shit. No, I just mean like if you if you compartmentalize. <laughs> lost me with the six pack. If you got yeah, he wants to hold to put them in bins. Fucking Bud Light babies, <laughs> this bitch. Just like. If you compartmentalize them so you didn't like it, where every baby was like six babies. Why and are then, you holding the babies? Because like? there's a oh handle. God. There's a handle. It is a, there's a <laughs> you do, look look look. We do gotta store these motherfuckers. There is a just storage thing. Put them thing. in seats. You like, can't. I said 400 car seats. Right. You put them in there. Yeah, dude. Who's there, gonna change all the diapers? babies in worse conditions. You want, here's there's the so thing. much shit. Here's attendance. the thing. So you have to hire like twenty attendants. No, only like five if you have Ugh. them in six packs. Because exactly. then you just dip the babies in a pool and shake them all off, and now those six are uh, clean. Yes, y'all it's, need to be sterilized. I'm talking I hope y'all never have line. Line. This is terrible. I'm talking about then, Ford principles applied. And the first to, class babies get the best attention. So the white babies, <laughs> they get <laughs> the white babies. This is the affluent baby no. and the not football play, the football player baby. Yeah. Okay, so yes. the black not babies. Not, okay, not a race issue. A J- class J- issue. Jay Z and Beyonce's kid will be up there. Oh yeah. Whatever that apple that Gwyneth yeah. had, all of them yes. in the fucking front. Right. Business Select, all of that. You can have all business of that select. for <laughs> babies <laughs> on their own plane. Not a fan. And it'd be a peaceful flight for you. Okay. It, you can come with a monitor. I'm still going to say You pay no. the extra $12 to look like yeah, you can have a fuck, Yeah, you have a no. fucking camera on every you one of them. You got a camera? So you know nothing goes it's wrong. It's so much money for this that's not needed but when the babies no, the amount. So but hear me out. So the so amount of money that other regular people will pay to not be on a baby flight. Yeah, guarantee. Okay. Will pay if for all of this. If it you could just put a be one... a soundproof section of the plane for yeah. the babies in okay, the back. Okay, okay, I'm in. What? I'm in. That's How are we building compartments? <laughs> <laughs> you better go put a baby in a fucking bin and a create a six pack of babies. That's so much more money <laughs> no, than just building what you another is, section of the plane no, or just, you just j- siphoning it off. You just convert right. Spirit Airline. That's the worst into one. Baby. That's no. an awesome flight They're babies. They don't care. I'm, no, that's an awesome. I'm selection. not. I don't want to fly Spirit. I'm not gonna non-stop, baby. non-baby. Nope. That's your that's your I, selection. I gotta find this and, and it works because they don't have carry-ons. Mm-mm. They oh, don't. Ha- I mean, very bag. true. They're basically just carry-ons. It's a check bag. Yeah. They already got diaper bags uh, on there. <laughs> <laughs> that's really what Y'all you gonna did. Kill it. 500 babies because you no, don't fly just the baby. in the we're, we're like 250 max, <laughs> and that's just in that's just in the trials. We're yeah, the details. Some of them are going to make it. You got to do your research, Roxy. I'm, I there, refuse. There isn't a lot of shit happening on planes. We got like three or four <laughs> incidents. We got 9-11. There's so many more things. And snakes. 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 <laughs> snakes. That was we one. We don't have that much shit. It's not a lot of shit that's happening up there. Not a fan. It's, it's actually. You know what? And that's what, that's what you call it. Nine to, <laughs> nine to 11 month old. <laughs> <laughs> you write that one down. Nine to eleven month old. Yeah, you got a. I don't want any of this to You have a nine to eleven month old. Fly nine. Fly nine eleven airlines. Uh, it's actually a better chance of something happening uh, your child carpooling than exactly. in a flight. That's exactly. true. Statistically. But I don't yeah. let her carpool either. So I don't let. I don't like people around my child. Are you a safe mom? Would you say you're a good mom? Yeah. I don't like people around my child. Yeah, heli- I mean, helicopter mom? Huh? Do you hover? Nah. Nah. I'm like a. Leave me alone. I'll leave you alone. But I'm also gonna watch you to make sure like shit doesn't happen to you. But also like leave me the fuck. Alone. Oh, so like her fly on her own plane with a camera that's on her. Maybe. 
<laughs> but now, like 11, 12, not like a baby. Right. Hell yeah, as a baby. Like, you know, That's the toughest time. You ain't getting no sleep. I would catch a flight as a new parent just to get sleep. Okay, I can A long flight. That's okay. When you're, not, when you're not sleeping in that beginning stage, you're like, fuck it, let's go to Paris. Well, when, I got to rest well, up. Let's go to Paris. <laughs> now, here's the thing, fuck though. Fuck this kid. Let's we go gotta, to Paris. If we're going to make overseas flights places where adults can sleep, then we got to also have their own flights for Asian people who fly with their goddamn shoes off oh, and God. sleep in the oh, aisle. These are adult issues. It's, to deal with. No, but they're on the same plane we got, that we just got the babies out of. That just means there's. No, this we is what cannot we cannot have separate but equal airlines, Slade. <laughs> separate. <laughs> I don't like it at all. Wait, which part? The, okay, it's, uh, all right, white people's feet. Um, <laughs> <laughs> wait, is it feet? Is that what's Well, called? all of it, period. But white think? people have uh, worse feet. Thank you for flying a, uh, Jim Crow Airlines. <laughs> <laughs> The, Just no, remember, yeah, no, uh, the so sections great. are reserved. It's it's everybody on an overseas flight devolves into, uh, if you want to know what post-apocalyptic America would be like, get on an overseas flight and look at the state of affairs about five hours into that flight. Yeah, oh. Everyone is devolved. There are cook fires. Cook the, fires. In the <laughs> actual aisle. Cook what? fires? Yes, okay. it's, a, it's an absolute de-evolution of humanity. Yeah. Shoes flight. come off. Yeah. People just flopped in the aisles, drool hanging. They're sleeping on strangers. What I, is I don't, this? An international flight. Yeah. Oh, you yeah, made this you sound like a hostel in the it air. Is. Yeah, yes. it is. It yes. is. It is a hostel I'll environment. Here. It's not <laughs> that bad. You have, when was the last time you flew? You've been on one plane in your whole I'm life. You went to, to really? I'm about to be on my second plane. Actually, I've been on two planes. I've been on the arrival. And you're and already departure. you're already bitching about kids. And I'm about to get yeah, on. Yeah, wait a minute. Oh, Fuck oh, you. You don't. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no Listen, I'm next Monday you go. I wish these bitches would stop leaning their seats back. <laughs> <laughs> this is all. This is all me. Just you know me. I don't. I don't know the. I've never seen the references. Like I, I'll reference Schindler's <laughs> oh, List, but I've never seen sense. the movie. Okay. I know what all. happened. There's a list and a red coat. Okay. Holocaustal <laughs> shit. I don't, I don't yeah, know. That's, that's basically Schindler's List. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly that's So I've yeah. heard people yeah. be upset about babies being on planes. I'm like, why the fuck they'll just have a plane just for babies? I'm this just is trying a brilliant to idea, song. Trey. I am with you. I'm just outside observing. I, I, and yeah. I'm against it simply and because of how quickly it, Rob got on your side. And if you put mm -hmm, a $2 mm -hmm. charge on every Suspect. ticket. Every I, every ticket sold in America, a two dollar charge that would fund a baby plane and fuel that <laughs> people, motherfucker. And people would fuel it, and they would say happily take my two dollar exactly. charge to fund the baby plane to, to, fl exactly. to fund nine eleven plane. <laughs> you like the nine eleven plane? Is nine eleven to eleven months. I do not endorse yeah. this. I don't endorse that this. I will fly nine eleven airlines. I don't airline. this. <laughs> I know I'm not part yeah, of this. you say that till the baby plane <laughs> till the baby plane airline launches, and you're like, "Where's Hell my motherfucking yeah. cut?" I was. <laughs> yeah, definitely want the money. I was I on that episode. <laughs> just, just like two percent. You can I'll even have like older kids like volunteers. Like, hey, bro, if you so, help out with the babies uh, on the plane, did you just your flight is free? Did so you just, child labor? No, trustees. No, you labor. turn trustees. this. <laughs> I didn't say that. It's a free flight. This is getting better. Child labor is so not the same. It's better. And it's international airspace. You don't have to pay them shit. That's, I mean, uh, I know but I'm, not, I'm not saying You save on labor. food. You save on luggage. You save on, 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 on oh, fucking Rob has, a shit ton of stuff. It's a brilliant idea. Rob has endorsed idea. this and it bothers me. I hate it. I it's do a great too. idea. This is a great idea. Uh, we're going to take 9-11 Airlines. We're going to take a quick break. 9-11 Airlines. 9-11 Airlines. 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 Just call it Virgin Airlines. Right. Oh, no. <laughs> I do not endorse this. <laughs> I need them to know I don't endorse <laughs> this. I don't endorse it. <laughs> Virgin, literally, Virgin Airlines. We're coming we're right back. Take a break. Roxy, you are on uh, social media. Is everything at Roxy Hayes? Mm -hmm. One extra two. <laughs> two. Two. <laughs> <laughs> so let's send these people after you. Uh, no. Go there. Uh, Roxy Hayes is joining us. Uh, your social media is amazing. I want to talk Thank about you. some of that, but we're also going to figure out uh, you and Trey's relationship, and I like that there is one. <laughs> More us uh, when we come back on the Whiskey Brothers podcast. Huh. Are you new to the Whiskey Brothers? Then check out the legendary first 400 episodes. Access the archives at praisewhiskey.com. Welcome back to the Whiskey Brothers podcast. Do me a favor, drunk dial us, will you? 323-510. Shot. Ha ha. 323-510-7468. The drunk dial phone number, uh, very easy to get a hold of us. You can also find us on all of our social at Praise Whiskey. Uh, we're on there individually as well. Uh, and our guest, Roxy Hayes, can be found at Roxy Hayes. Two X's. Yeah. There you go, Rob. I oh my God! I know. I poured stuff all yeah. over the table. Way to go, man! I know. Oh, man. I'm not a similar yet. That? Oh yeah! Cheers! Yeah. Oh my to, uh, God! To you guys, Trey. You and Roxy know one another. Uh, Ro <laughs> you, I mean, we all know you, Roxy. But <laughs> Hi. when I when I when I when I float guests out, 
no is a strong word. We we always <laughs> I always float names out and I go, hey, I'm just look here's here's who I'm yeah. thinking of uh, for the next <laughs> couple of months. What? This, this fucking guy. You never you, everybody throws names out. You just say no. <laughs> no. no. Okay. But no. also no. sometimes I float Fuck, the, Yeah, sometimes right? come on. Come sometimes on, I veto everybody. Yeah, yeah. everybody. Yeah. Sometimes but everybody. Sometimes I float a few names out. Sometimes uh, he does float names. And yeah. as of recently, I <laughs> floated <laughs> As of four days ago, you know, he wrote names. Often I'm putting names out there, and you guys are shutting me down. I didn't say, I never yeah. said. <laughs> so I never guy, said you were shutting them ago, down. I never said you shut anything down. Uh, um, I said I we floated. We ended up saying yes because he finally floated some names. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, all these names are great. Yeah. That's what we said six months ago. Since you suggested them. Uh, yeah. it's fantastic. All right. But anyway, you were floating names. <laughs> Uh, Back to these it. names being close. <laughs> All right, your your name came up. Uh, <laughs> I think Rob brought and it up. And it was at the top of the list. Trey, yeah, Rob yeah. brought it up, and four other people were like, "Yes." Oh, and yay. then I I yeah. rang in, um, and then Trey. Uh, <laughs> What'd you say? No, Trey, go, Trey yeah. goes, yes. And then I think you two were both sort of telling me at the same, you're just kind of a, oh, Trey, oh, Roxy. And I was like, y'all good, right? And everybody yeah. was like, we're good. And that's all I know. So. Oh, uh, man. <clears throat> I'll let you tell. Yeah. Okay. Let's get okay. a National Women's so, uh, Day. So. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to turn you down for National Women's Day. I'm really not great at telling stories. I'll just say that now. I, tell, I, t- I put too much exposition. So I was, okay. okay. The story has to start at this point to understand how it got to this point. So I was at the improv one day. Uh-huh. Um, and this is, I was with Chinadu, my homie, Chinadu uh-huh. Ogu. And we were standing there and Josh Stokes was there. And me and Chinadu were talking and we heard somebody fart. We okay. heard a fart. And we were not sure who did the fart. And I was very high at this moment. How many people were in the action? It was vicinity? just Josh. We were like standing well, on the I think little y'all ramp. Know. Yeah. So, <laughs> but I don't want to accuse him exactly on the airways. We are not sure to this day who did the fart. This was like two or three years ago. Okay. Yeah. So I said, I just looked at him and I've never met him before or said anything. I was like, yo, bro, did you fart? And <laughs> <laughs> And How did this friendship go sideways? Okay, so J- Josh, and this J- Josh got real man. You know, Josh be talking with his hands. He's like, yeah. you don't even know me. <laughs> and you going to ask me if I farted? Yeah. So that's, <laughs> I was like, hey, you didn't say no. So I'm going to assume you farted. So later, we go to, what the fuck was that place? Boondocks. We was at Boondocks. Yeah. And so I'm just standing so there. another open mic. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So then Josh comes up and he's like, you just telling everybody I farted? You go tell everybody I farted? And so that's how it kind of, the well, conversation. But were you at Boondocks like really running that story? Or no, was I was just standing there. No, and he was just hanging. still mad and that I had drove said. over there with it on his mind. Yeah, he was just so, so mad. Saying, Look at this fart. Look at this. Fart <laughs> over here. She over here going to tell everybody I farted. I, I know what I did, fart. but why everybody else got to know, know I, I farted? And so I was like, hey, man, you don't have to talk. So I don't remember. So that's how Trey walked over because they're friends. And I, I, yeah. I remember what you said, but now I don't remember now. You, he has said something real. St- you know, he be saying, Trey. Trey's, Trey's a Trey. troll. At yeah. this point, I, I have understand. I, I, you're, ain't real. Motherfucker, you're a troll. And he is a troll pertaining to race. Oh, yes. Like, like uh, he, yeah, he always talking shit about black women. I know that about you now. However, no. any, shut the fuck up. <laughs> so anybody who knows me knows that I am extremely, extremely pro-black. Uh-huh. So yeah. meeting, I didn't know this. well now you know, motherfucker. <laughs> so meeting <laughs> a, a, a an anti black troll, I was you know not. what I'm saying? Let me go back. Anyway, Try- so I'm still <laughs> talking. So <laughs> I don't remember what exact. Oh no, I remember now. Let me tell you. T- tell me this is not the stupidest shit to I say hope to a motherfucker. Don't say this wrong. No, he was I like, hope you don't say. This oh, wrong. I know who you are, because mind you, like I'm just meeting all these people. Right. I don't really go to mics at this point. I'm right. kind of sure. I'm popping in these streets. Right, right. So anyway, so. Newish. He's like, oh, I know who you are. I was going to follow you, but you were too dark. Wrong. No, what you uh, say then, mother? That's not what, what I you say. I said, say it. I was like, I, 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 was like, I just met you, and <laughs> I would add you, but you're dark skinned. That's it. Oh, I, oh that's so, much better. You so, were going to laugh he just because you're both he fucking just made dark skinned. You just made it worse. Yes. Because I was not amused. She um, said it way better. I did say it better. Yours is worse. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah but I didn't mean it, nigga. Like, I'm not the same. Like, <laughs> the fuck? I just met you. 
and we're both dark skinned. Why the fuck are we gonna be like? You. He's uh -huh. being sarcastic. I, I was gonna say, does your mirror have a light? His humor. No, I didn't. Outside of this open mic, I didn't add you because I, I didn't know you, and I felt it was more he offensive to say I didn't skin. know you he said than to say it was because you was dark skinned. I didn't give a fuck if you didn't know me. I'm not like a famous. It see, it felt like that. Well, that's just because I have. You accuse the niggas of farting on the fly. He did fart. He can say he didn't. Josh, you farted. I believe like, he, he farted, farted too. He farted. Josh farted. I don't care what he says. He farted. So it's the Zabruder film. Of I was like, <laughs> and this is you could you was, could distinctly see his butt yeah. cheek move back into the was, left. It yeah. was back it into was, the left. We are through the. <laughs> then he did it in front of all these white people. But that's not and what they were. You. And then shut up. And then they was uncomfortable. <laughs> and I was like, yo, like I'm a. F I wasn't even like, cause I'm not a person that just generally gets offended. But when it yeah. comes to race uh -huh. for, and colorism, I was like, this motherfucker really shut the fuck up. He, I was like, he really gonna pull out this colorism no. shit and this is what made it bad so a, a particular <laughs> Caucasian comic who I will not name right now because he's okay. out here doing sexual assault and shit and I don't want to give him Ooh, no airplay shit. so he was like Fair. he he was like so you really gonna say that to a person that like book shows and you like you don't know her like you're gonna yeah. offend and so I'm like the white man is making logic to the, <laughs> and I was just I was upset that a white person had to tell you why it was wrong. You was upset to say with the colorism shit. Yes. I thought it was something else. What you? Oh, that you didn't know me. That I was a no. That was the first thing. Now oh. here, here's what I, here's what I want to see. I want to see. Let's let's Fuck let's reach into Trey's head and see what Plinko the Chip logic. comes out because there is there is logic behind this. Is it? But though? it's gonna be some weird. It's gonna be stupid. It's no. I just thought that you were gonna be like really or whatever. Like really like whatever. And I'm like I'm just fucking. You around. thought I was. I thought cool. it was gonna be that, but you mm -hmm. didn't say anything, and I was like I probably fucked. <laughs> she got quiet. I was like, all right, all right. I don't know how I'm going to dig out of this. Okay. But then you kept saying other shit Dis after okay, that. Okay, so I'll tell you the other thing I said that I thought really set it off. So I was like, I don't I don't go to movies yes! where there's a lot of black people on the cover I was, because yeah. I already know what's going to be inside. I already know what's going to happen. Right? Why so it was like, you? so you don't see I any. And it was like, you don't see any Tyler Perry movies? I'm like, no. Oh, and I don't like I Tyler Perry like, movies, so that, that wasn't the part that made and me And I was like, that. when I look at that cover, that looks like somebody bought they niggas in bulk. And <laughs> then everybody laughed, and, and then you was ignoring it. And then somebody repeated it, and you was like, why would you say that? I was just like. And I was like, well, I was like, he just, this is a bad start. <laughs> like, he really just. This yeah, you I'm like, like this is how yeah. this person is, and so like, and this nigga hated me for three years. Oh, so yeah. okay, so here's here's the thing about me. Uh -huh. I am, a, I'm not gonna say I'm a nice person because I don't feel like I'm a nice person. I am a very blunt, honest person mm -hmm. right. with a with a I guess a pleasant disposition. I'm not necessarily a nice person. Uh, okay, so okay. when I don't like a motherfucker, I'm not gonna be like a bitch to you. Like I'm not one of them assholes. It's like fuck Trey going around. Nah, like I said, I'm just not gonna talk. Right, to should you. just go to the next uh, bar and tell people you farted. Yeah. Like, that's, <laughs> <laughs> so I just so like I would see okay this this could be perceived as bitchy behavior and when I was doing it I, I wasn't even thinking about it I would legit just ignore him so like he yeah. would be in a circle and I would be talking to everybody and he would be like right there and I'd just be like yeah da 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 and then walk away no I would not look I would not make eye contact which is hard as shit with him but he's already crooked but I'm like six foot so I just would look. Yeah. Regular eye level. <laughs> <laughs> and just graze my afro. Like Yes, but like uh, you're you like in your hair. Yeah. When you were like best friends or friends with somebody that was dating my like somebody I was cool with. So like they were always he yeah. would always be I just wouldn't say shit. Right. Yeah, she would. But it was one huh. time that I did feel like it was wrong because you were <laughs> Go ahead, what you were in the sound booth at the improv and it was only two people in there and I oh. went in there I was like, "Hey, and I just walked out. And I just walked oh. out. Yeah, that was, I was, yeah. And I was like, okay, that was kind of mean. But I didn't yeah, give a that's, fuck. That's not yeah. a good person. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> I didn't care. I was like, no, it was like, fuck so You I said hi like, to the other person. Yeah, yeah okay. I said, and I was so uh, nice too. And I was just like, oh, yeah. nah, okay. Yeah. And so then Tressa, What's I guess, up? I guess you had said something to Tressa. Well, everybody was like, how, how come, they, you know, they, we would, they would ask about each other. Yeah. Is this still like weird friction? <laughs> and I was Sorry. like, what is that about? And I was like, it's a misunderstanding. Uh, that's all I would ever say. <laughs> Uh, and they was like, "Why y'all don't?" Because you had stuff you were doing, and it was like you could really, you know, help with input. Nope. And I was like, "She does not deal with me in that way." <laughs> and when black women don't fuck with you, that's oh, the yeah, boat you're, you're in. Like you can't. <laughs> yeah, you there's no know. way to paddle course, out of that motherfucker. Of course, like, what, he said, what he said is like, you know, when black women, they will fuck, especially her. She's very black. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and she will not fucking talk shit. to me. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I didn't mean any of that. But <laughs> I didn't mean any of that. I. I I don't know. I'm new to colorism and all that shit. I, I, I'm new how, to. How 
Oh, what? I'm new to that being a bad thing. So I you don't, just not I just, hang around black people? Is that- I grew up around poor white people. Okay. So, so I, I got to explain this to okay. you. So okay. it was like. Yeah, you did. You did. You did. And I was, I was high, like, I, I grew so, around. And, the, this, blah, blah. and then after I after I learned that, I was like, okay, he's just ignorant. Like, yes. that's like, not like. But now I know, I know, I know. He literally doesn't yeah, know. he literally doesn't know. But how, when you say it, I picture the way yeah. I know Trey, where yeah, I'm like, ignorant, ah, no, ignorant, 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 she actually ignorant, said, she's just one of, she actually said, this, she's, he's, he's one of these ignorant black people. <laughs> who <laughs> don't understand. Wow, when you say, okay. See, when yeah, I, that, that sounds yeah, okay. bad. It sounds bad, but, yeah. <laughs> but like I said, okay, so. I mean, it, he's a very, he's just, very black person. Yeah, he's also just, ignorant. Ignorant. <laughs> so, he's just real ignorant. And like, ignorant. And if you understood my background, because like my father was an African-American exactly. studies professor, and I grew sure. up this, right. and do, you know, so it's like, oh, yeah. I'm not used to dealing with people that just hang around. White. I don't really like white people that much. Like, no, we're but, awful. But, we're yeah, generally like, fucking trash. Like, historically, you trash. Absolutely. We're, but, yeah. so, I don't, and I, when you told me I this, I was it, like, oh, she's the type of black people I was always afraid of. Yes, but hi. We got one of those, we got one of those Astros, Astros, is by all of our wins. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah. I caught all of that shit late. Yes. So I, I, I was around too many <laughs> white people to start hating them. I was like, yeah. you know what? They're I really don't feel bad. the same you anymore. Shoulda. Yeah, I caught your <laughs> shit late. But then I was like, well, I'm here now. So Tressa is like my homie. I hang right. out with Tressa a lot. So for context, Tressa is another, she's yes. another, uh, she's producing a lot of shows, but another mm-hmm. young black female comedian yes. in the scene. So she was like, hey, stop being mean to Trey. And I was like, no. <laughs> Yeah. And she was like, I think it's hurting his feelings. No. He said something to me about it. And like, I know you're not being mean, but you're ignoring him, which can be perceived as being mean. Perce- I was like, I don't give a fuck. Like, yeah. you know, blah, blah, yeah. blah. And so I was like, OK, I will make amends because as my friend, this is something that you're saying I should do and uh-huh. I'm going to do it. So I had wrote out. She, I wrote out something. She, I was like, I'm going to just message him on Facebook. And I was like, I'm about to message him. And she was like, no, send it to me first because <laughs> you don't know how to talk. And so what I had said was like, hey, I'm reaching out like. I understand that your coony behavior that you're <laughs> doing is not necessarily something that you are doing on purpose, and I'm going to stop. And she was like, "We like that shit. That's how you fucking talk to people." And I was like, "I'm being honest. So I, I don't remember exactly how I rewrote it, but like, she made me change no, it like four you, times. I mean, yeah. She made me change it four that times. That was the gist. <laughs> <laughs> that's like, that's what I took away from it. No, but it was like I was. You was like the third person to tell me that. There was a few other black comments like, hey, bro, I don't know, but you out here on some coon shit cooning. at a very low level. Mm-hmm. Like, you don't even have millions. I was like, I was like, all right. Cooning early. Yeah, I was like, I, well, I didn't know. I don't, I'm just like, like you said, like you said you're, you, you're ignorant of it and the behaviors, and that's yes. not something, that, so you're not necessarily. And then when I was able to look at it, I was like, oh, man, I've been so wrong for so long. <laughs> and, and, and then when I was talking to Tressa, I was like, I was like, I'd reach out to her, but I, I feel like it'll be an empty a gesture. Yeah. I was like, if, if she reads out, I'm cool to, I don't have any beef. I don't know Roxy enough <laughs> to be mad at her. You know what I mean? Well, she didn't slash my tires. Or, I would. I, I will. I, will. <laughs> I thought about it. I, I will say this. Um, I am glad you two pieced it back together. Your chemistry makes me happy. Uh, <laughs> uh, Roxy, Only because it's you telling me to shut the fuck up. <laughs> And I can't just go on tangents. Because because 300 other people listening just went, oh, thank God somebody said it. (laughs) (laughs) Said shut the fuck up or the coony behavior. All of them. And they'll all be booking flights on that (laughs) airline. (laughs) Guarantee you. When 9 to 11 month old airline. I'm glad you brought the name up, Slade. I really am. (laughs) That's you. Reached out yeah. that I floated the, it out yeah, there to yeah. the comedy community and, as and a whole. Like, and like I was telling Slade, I was like, because he was like, "Yeah, you and Trey good." I was, I was like, "Yeah, we're cool." Like even when people would like ask me, like, "Hey, is Trey funny?" Like, would you put him on? I'm like, "Yeah, I've seen him. Yeah, He's exactly. funny." Like you yeah. know, put him on. I would never be like on no hate and shit because I'm never gonna just purposely take money out of somebody. Even if I hate your ass, if yeah. you're funny oh. and I feel like you would be an asset to a show, I would still. I'm petty as shit. I I will. <laughs> oh, I, I heard. I heard. <laughs> we got to get out of here. Follow Roxy Hayes. Oh, done. R O X X Y. You're sticking oh. around for Friday's episode though. Oh, um, so you'll hear more of her and uh, definitely more with Trey. We're easy to find. Drunk Dallas again. Three two three five one zero seven four six eight. Yeah, that shot. Um, you guys, thank you for following along via video. Uh, we have great things coming like a cat. To, the, <laughs> <laughs> so to the Patreon account, uh, and I'll update you on all of that later. Episode 800 happens April 1st at Darwin's Pub. Find us there. More information on our Facebook page. We'll see you guys soon. They don't want no problem. Nah. Music provided by Scarface. Thank you for listening to yet another excellent episode of the Whiskey Brothers Podcast, the world's funniest podcast ever. The Whiskey Brothers Podcast was made in America by Americans, mostly in and around the Houston area. All content copyright the Whiskey Brothers. This concludes our broadcast day.
goodbye.